Hi YouTube, it's Miss Rakita and today I just wanted to do an update on the organics unit that I am wearing in Marigold. Um, I washed and conditioned her again and um, I just put a few um, two strand braids in there and dampened it and then let it dry overnight and this is the completed look. Um, I am getting ready for work, so yeah, um, I didn't put, I forgot to put on my earrings and my necklace and stuff like that, but I just wanted to show you this hair, um, I've had for a few weeks now, and, um, I'm definitely loving it, um, this is the Organics Unit in Marigold, it is, um, off black with burgundy highlights. I was thinking of the spec numbers, but I don't remember them. And every time I get ready to record, I don't have the information um, next to me. So yeah, um, this is it. And let's see if I can turn around and show you guys the back. Um, nothing special. I did not curl her. I washed and conditioned her. And this is her natural curl pattern. And then I just put um, some braids in there and just tie rubber bands at the bottom while it was damp. And then just let it dry overnight and took them down. And this is pretty much it. i um, trying to be simple and not take all day because putting on my makeup takes all day and then to throw on a wig that's just more time so yeah this is pretty much it and then I wanted to talk to you guys about the face that I am rocking today my face of the day I am using my elf 100 palette um, from this palette I believe I am wearing only two or three colors um, the first one is this brown right there I am wearing um, this brown right here under my brow to kind of like mute out that concealer. And then for a highlight, I am using this color um, right there. So that is it from the e.l.f. 100 palette. Um, my lid is broken, so that's what you get when you deal with e.l.f. Um, let's see, for my, uh, contour, I don't know if you guys can see that, I just, I have a huge problem with this lighting, but for my contour, as you can see, I'm using my NYC color wheel in the, um, all over bronze glow. This is it right here. And those are the colors. And for a blush, I am wearing... Elf in Tickled Pink. Oh, sorry. There she is. Uh, let's see. Um, goodness gracious me. I know for my lips, I am using my NYX Nude on Nude palette. The lip colors, these two pinks right here. And, um... I just posted a picture on face grant face gram, Facebook and Instagram on the Maybelline Colossal Biome Express that I am using today for my lashes. No falsies for me. Um, for my bottom lash line, I am using the Maybelline Lash Stiletto in soft black. Um, I talk about these two in a lot of my videos. I'm telling you, you guys have got to try these. You have definitely got to try these. Um, I use... Lately, what I've been doing is using this at the top and this at the bottom. But before I start doing that, I would use this first to extend the lash. And then right before it dries, I will put this on it to plump it up. It has um, nine times the volume with um, collagen, nine times the collagen. So um, that's great. Um, let's see. For my face, I of course, I am using my e.l.f. Tinted Moisturizer in Almond. And to set that, I am using my Bare Minerals Original 
My color is golden tan, and I just use that to kind of like set it. I use a very, very small amount, and I just put that on the brush that comes with the kit, the full uh, flawless face brush. And um, for my eyes, I am using my Milani uh, eye pencil in brown black. And then to soften it or smoke it out, I had used the e.l.f. 100 palette and that uh, brown. This is the brown that I had used to smoke out under my eye to soften it up. Um, I wish I could, you know, get this lighting together so that you can see it because this this lighting does this look no justice and I cannot get this e.l.f. palette to go back to the way it was. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I did show what I was using for the lips. Um, my primer is the Revlon Photo Ready. As you can see, I am going out of that. And then let's see if I can do a close-up of the face without blinding you with this stupid light. I am using my iPhone 4S, so just bear with me. So I'm going to pull the phone up to my face so you can see the eyes and then the lips and then the soft contouring that I am going for and I'm just pulling the phone back so that you can see it because the closer you are upon it it kind of looks like too much but it's very very soft and natural daylight um it is rain well I'm not it's not raining but it's cloudy so in the natural light it will look perfect and then you know um this little lace front that I'm rocking so I'm trying to fall into the fall trend of browns and reds and greens and things like that I'm slowly transitioning I have not been wearing makeup for a lot of years so um I rather take my time so I'm just doing like a soft brown eye nothing too extravagant I did use the elf 100 palette for that everything is brown everything is soft and um, easy to use for my top lash line I even went brown I am wearing my Maybelline waterproof liquid eyeliner and this is brown this is pretty old but oh yeah there's the color it's just in, in regular brown let me see if I can show you that just in brown so yeah that's pretty much it um, I'm probably gonna throw on my accessories because it's almost time for me to get ready to go but I wanted to shoot this video to show you guys what I'm rocking this fall or what I'm trying to do so I'm slowly trying to follow the fall trend this time I'm usually scared of those colors because if you do not use them properly you can definitely look like a mess real fast so I, I'd rather go slow that way if I make a mistake it is easily um, able to be fixed so for that that's what I'm trying to do so um, on that note I'm already at my 835 minute mark I'm going to end this video thank you guys for tuning in make sure you comment rate and subscribe it is totally free press that button up there and um yeah, I will talk to you in the next video. Bye.